I think in general we're in a market today where simplicity is expensive and complexity is relatively cheap. So if you don't look for things that are disrupted, whether they're markets, which frankly aren't that disrupted, or individual situations, you could be in a position where you're buying assets that have a high correlation to low interest rates. And if rates start to move or if there's disruption somewhere, you'll have a lot of negative potential exposure. So we try to find things that are complex, that are disrupted, that are already in trouble, uh, because that's where you can find dollars that you can buy for 50 cents today.